Welcome back. We want to talk now about suicide. Historically, that word has been considered taboo in television news. As a general rule, and for a variety of reasons, we rarely cover stories of suicide. But that attitude is changing beginning today. Our Elise Haas has a look ahead to a brand new statewide effort to change the discussion and break the silence. Here are the facts. The suicide rate in our area is above the national average. More people die by suicide than die from car crashes, gun violence, or disease. It is a public health crisis. That's why, in coordination with Lines for Life, along with our media partners and competitors throughout the state of Oregon, Coin6 News is joining in a commitment to change our coverage and shine a light on suicide. We call it breaking the silence. Over the next week on Coin6 News this morning, I'll be bringing you statistics and stories. Separate the facts from fiction and end the stigma associated with suicide. Most of all, every day we'll be talking about how you can get help if you or someone you know needs it. You will see similar storytelling from newspapers, television, radio stations, and news websites throughout the region. How we all report on suicide will evolve, and in no way are we looking to sensationalize suicide. Rather, we look to provide you a better understanding of the issues and resources needed to address them. And while we know this won't solve the problem, what we do hope to do is start the conversation and confront the crisis head on. So that's Elise Haas. You can join us tomorrow morning as Elise takes a deep dive into suicide statistics here in our region and why the fears of contagion and copycat acts are not based in reality. That you can expect tomorrow morning on Coin 6 News. We'll be right back.